personnel. Whenever you are ready, step towards SCP-1437. Hello everybody, SCP is here, and welcome to SCP-1. Uh, oh god, the number was just on the fucking screen. I've already fucking forgot it. I'm an idiot. Sorry. 1437. A whole to another place. Sorry about that. I am dumb. Brain not functioning. Um, but yeah, this is a, an SCP game. This is a very interesting environment. Uh, this is an SCP game all about the whole to another place. Uh, which is a very interesting SCP to me because one of those ones that like focuses on like alternate realities. Because the whole thing about this is like, it's a pit that just leads to other realities. And it's so, so interesting. I was expecting there to be a menu, uh, but I guess we're jumping into it. There was no menu, so. Do I land on things? Apparently. Okay, okay, I do. Anything I could like pick up or anything. So I guess I just continue my fall. Here for this building. I'm guessing I'm aiming for these random things. I take a guess. Gravity's funky here, though. Okay. Oh, God. Cell phone poles. <laughs> this is something special. I am so confused by what is happening. This is an interesting interpretation of this SCP in all honesty. Because, um, one of the things of it is just random shit just occasionally flies up out of it. And the only reason that they know that it's, like, from other realities is they've gotten messages from other realities. <laughs> Hello. Definitely couldn't miss. No, oh, I managed to miss this. You're a fucking wizard. The wrong ways. Locked safe. Okay. Are these like puzzles that I have to like solve? Alter. Okay. House. Okay, I'm starting to think this is just this SCP, but the puzzle game weird platforming. I don't know what the fuck to do about most of it, though. This is very, very odd. This is, like... I get that SCP, like, has some weird-ass concepts in it, but this is one of those, like, very weird interpretations. Alright, let's see what's next. I'm guessing we're gonna be falling in cycles, considering there's a bunch of things I couldn't do anything about. Oh, that... I just phased through that? Okay. I don't know if there's fall damage, period. Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Okay, that's clever. They added this for anyone who fucking missed it. That, that's kind of clever. That's clever. I'll give them that. I'll give them that. So we're looking for the pipe area. The screwdriver. Oh, speak of the fucking devil. Dear God. Can I get inside the pipes? And I bet there's something hidden there. Uh, is this the house? That was some kind of weird, like, top of a tank thing. 
Try to tell what some of these things are. Locked door. Okay, there is a door here. Okay. What the fuck is that? SCP-617? What? What is the CP-617 doing here? What was 617? Hold on, I'm gonna pause the game real quick. I'm gonna tab out. I don't know why this one's here. It doesn't make any fucking sense. Why is 617 here? 617 is the pet rocks. Did I not see a zipper for a mouth? They were on that. Is this the house with a screwdriver? Okay, the house with a screwdriver! Oh, yes. I have gotten screwdriver. Alright. Working spigot. Okay. My spigot. Hopefully, this takes us back to. What the fuck? Not only do I have to solve the puzzle, but I also have to land these fucking stupid- Ah! An Easter egg island head. Fuck. What did I just land on? I am so confused on what's happening here. My brain is not equipped to deal with this right now. What the hell? I guess I'll... Ugh. Try to hit these buttons? Okay. Shit. I hope I can get back up. I don't think I can get back up. I have to go, like, multiple rounds, maybe? Not oh, gonna be able to get all those. Not with the way this physics engine wants to fucking work. Yeah, it's made in a Unity physics engine. But I think it's made in the older Unity physics engines. Because it feels so clunky. Oh no, shit. Well, looks like I fucking missed. Why are there security cameras? you guys are here? Or is this just to add to the trippy ass fucking feeling of this place? This is so weird. This is not what I expected to be playing. Like, the screenshots were weird. Don't get me wrong, but Jesus. This is definitely one of those weird game called games. Oh, hello. Rock among those. Who's there? I can't see. I've lost my face. Do I need to bring you the fucking uh, pet rock? Okay, mouth. I don't know why that would be a fucking ear, eyes, or ears. Well, the fucking English. Okay, so. There are already a lot of puzzles. So I'm very confused. What the hell I'm doing? I have screwdriver should be able to get explosive. Why do I need an explosive? What one do I use the explosive on? Do I use it on fucking 617? Maybe? The giant 617? I don't know why it's so big. In a lot of states, 617 is not that big. It's literally small rocks. It's like force people to feed them and make you go mad they're kind of they're, they're kind of creepy they're one of those creepy but you wouldn't think they're creepy ones this is such a fucking fall i don't know where i'm going this is this is such a weird way to interpret this scp i don't know how to feel about it in all honesty if i use the dynamite to blow up the safe in here Perhaps? Perhaps? Why is it green now? 
And it's just gonna unlock on its own. Now it's got a bunch of green lights on it. I'm very confused. As I probably should be. By literally everything is that is happening in front of me. Wait, no. The button's in the last level. Oh, I see. Okay, so I need to go through there and... Look. Ice block. Why? Why is there ice? There it is. What? Hey, give me your info. In the box, you'll find explosives. Yeah. There's a some sort of rock golem guy. Yeah, you should look for him. I give it to the rock golem. Uh, what? Okay, so I need to go the rock golem and blow up the golem. I don't know why I'm blowing up the golem, but... <laughs> I'm still so confused why there's just things in the wall. Um, but... Hello. That's it. Uh, what? light. Nothing under it. Oh, hello. Rock homunculus. I do now. I'm very confused. Okay, I did that. Did I fall again? Let's go! This should be if we're keeping with the same layout. Yep, it's a... carefully. Make sure I get every single button. None missed. <laughs> this is... This is an amount of fucking stupid that I hate. I think I got it. I got it. Okay, I think that that's it. That's all. That's all. I don't... I'm done. That entire area. I just realized I can kind of control my speed a bit. Oh. 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 oh, oh, oh. I hate that. I fucking hate that. Lighter. I see. This might be what I need for the rocket one. <laughs> or here. Large bolt. Huh? What do I use that for? Emergency exit. Do not block. I don't think this is the emergency exit, buddy, unless your emergency exit is just an exit to fucking reality. This is like liminal space shit, but on fucking steroids, I swear. It's so weird. Okay, where are you? I don't well, have a wrench. wrench. <laughs> so, I got a bolt. I did not get a wrench. I think they fucked up their puzzle. Where's the wrench? Where the fuck is the wrench? I might not be able to complete this and I'm slightly annoyed by- Oh, hello. What I did when I gave the guy the exp I made a boom go off and got rid of that fucker. Okay. Okay, so now I need to land the homunculus. 
next loop around. I need to land the homunculus. There's gonna control fall all the way to the next area. It's a fucking stupid loop, I will say that. Here, here, here. There we go. Um, Odd middle and I got the wrench. There we go. Okay, that's how you get the fucking wrench. You need the mask first. The fucking tutorial thing was telling me something that I didn't have yet. Noted. <laughs> it just kind of skips anything you haven't fully completed yet. Because it counts as completed. I just, I just need to control my fall more. That is, that is one thing that I'm having trouble with in this game, because you're just falling. That's all you're doing, and the fucking way you're falling is fucky. Ow, I just tangled my foot in my own cord for my fucking microphone. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, we have the wrench and the bolt. You can actually fucking do that task. Instead of the spigot not having, you know, the rest of its parts there. And I think the spigot is now the last puzzle that we've discovered that we haven't fixed. Right? I'm right in assuming that, right? This is such a... I've said it multiple times, this is really such a fucking weird game. Oh, wait, there's one puzzle we haven't solved yet. We will be with you shortly. Okay. In the safe, there'll be a lighter. And ironically, you'll find an ice block in a fireplace somewhere. I've already fucking done that. Fix the thingy about what the fuck? Who the fuck are these? Is this some other game the guys developed? I'm I'm confused. I really hope those two in that one pipe are a puzzle. Because if they are, um, I'm gonna be very fucked. Because that was not an easy thing to land. I'm really hoping they were just an easter egg. <laughs> For like, the guy's other games. And right down here, there we go. Baby. Please be what I need. Yes! Okay. I got the key. Okay, now I can unlock that door in the pipe area. Such a weird game, I swear to god. This is one of the weirdest things I will ever play for the channel, I can already fucking tell. <laughs> this is definitely one of those... I forgot to mention that this is a very old, um... SCP game, if it wasn't obvious from the whole way it is made. Uh... But yeah, I, you can tell... Listen, <laughs> The developer just had fun with... Size changing different fucking objects and shoving them into the wall and making you have to jump on them. Which I don't mind. It's just very odd. It's a very odd choice. Oh, hello. I was definitely not supposed to land here again. <laughs> very, I will say it is a very interesting, um, game mechanic to just be falling instead of, like, climbing. You have to, like, control the fall. And, like, I know a lot of games have actually done this. Uh, a lot of them do it in, like, in, like, the 2D space, not the 3D first person. Like this one does. That is very interesting. That is an interesting thing to note. And a very interesting uniqueness of the game. I haven't played many games that, like, actually have you first-person controlling falls like this. I've had them first-person controlling falls in other ways, but also never like this. Jimmy, we're gonna check for anyone who is curious if there's anything about Jimmy. That was one. No Easter eggs. Nope. I'm noticing that there's a fucking big space between... 
explosives and screwdriver. Up in my uh, items list. Which concerns me a little bit. There's also a lot more spaces after key. So, um, is there another section we're gonna get access to after we can lose? Or, uh, is it gonna be it? We're just gonna land here. Let's hear. Your call may be monitored or recorded. If you have a key, you have to unlock a door. Did I really have to explain that last one? Not really, no. I just wanted to know if there was something else you wanted to tell me that I missed. Okay, so it seems that you two aren't fucking anything. Davy and Jinxx. I think those are the developers, actually. So that's a you got a kind of cool Easter egg. Some 2D sprites in the middle of this 3D game. Sorry, what the? Zero seven four. What is that doing here? Are you? Light Doctor? Uh. I'm gonna reset. Jesus Christ, that was loud as fuck. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> um. Yeah, 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 shut up. Okay, anyway, I hope everyone has enjoyed. If you should join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't forget to shoot the like button, subscribe the comments, and contain the subscribe button. This is a very interesting game. There will be links in the description, of course, in the comments. Or in the comments, well, in the description. <laughs> I'm having a fucking stroke. Anyway, uh, this is very interesting, very weird. And uh, I'll see you all in the next video, live stream, or whatever next. Peace, guys.